Welcome back. Since we have so many new subscribers here on this channel, and thank you for that, I want to do just a recap of where is Vero Beach, Florida? On this channel, I talk about all things Vero Beach, Florida every single week. Um, I share about what I love about living here, why it's a family-friendly place to live. I share about school um, information, cost of living, the different neighborhoods that we have, new construction, all kinds of great things, um, buying and selling tips about this area in Vero Beach and the surrounding areas of the space in the Treasure Coast. But again, since we have so many new people on this channel now, I wanted to do a video for you that talks about where exactly is Vero Beach, Florida. So for those of you who are watching, who are considering Vero Beach as an option for yourself or your family, for a place to settle down, a place to live, I wanna um, give you a little bit of information about where exactly is Vero Beach located and what makes it so special. As you can see in some of my other videos, if you've watched them on this channel, Vero Beach, I talk about this a lot, is where the tropics begin in Florida. So everything north of Vero Beach is not considered the Florida tropics, even though Florida in general is a tropical um, weather state. But Vero Beach actually is really special because it's where the Florida tropics begin. So Vero South is all tropical Florida all the way down to the Keys, to the tippy tip of Florida. Bureau Beach is located about halfway down the state on the Atlantic coast, all right? It's nestled right up against the Atlantic Ocean and Bureau Beach is made up of a barrier island. So that's a strip of land, which in this case nestles um, the Atlantic ocean on one side and the Indian River Lagoon on the other side. And then Vero Beach has a mainland portion as well that extends all the way out Yeehaw Junction out to a little bit south of Okeechobee. About an hour and a half north of Vero Beach, you're gonna find um, the very famous Cocoa Beach. So it's a well-known vacation and party destination. That's an hour and a half north of us and then also just north of Coco in Titusville, um, you're gonna find the Kennedy Space Center and NASA and the home of the new SpaceX program and everything space all up there. It's really cool, really neat, but most people know the Kennedy Space Center, most people know Coco Beach. So for a reference point, that's about an hour and a half north. About an hour and a half northwest, you're gonna find Orlando, Disney World, malls, like all fun things, Orlando Universal Studios, and a ton of fun theme parks. An hour and a half south is West Palm Beach, which is also a very well-known vacation and shopping destination. Um, West Palm also has a great airport that you can fly in and out of, same with Orlando, um, and then about two hours south of Vera Beach, you're gonna find Miami, Florida. So everybody knows about Miami. And for those of you who have been to the West Coast, just for another like um, reference point, Sarasota, Florida, which is also a well-known destination on the Gulf side, is really exactly straight across the state from Vero Beach. So geographically that should give you some idea of where vero beach sits amongst some of the very well-known florida destinations so unlike these well-known florida destinations that i just mentioned vero beach is a completely different vibe vero beach is a very like small town feel more of a sleepy um, vacation type of city or large town is how I would describe it. So not even close to being comparable to Coco, Orlando, West Palm, or Miami. Completely different vibe, completely different feeling. It's more of a very residential, um, family-centric, slower-paced town in Florida. It's beautiful. Um, Vero Beach has done a really great job of preserving a lot of the green space and the natural beauty in the area. We've got a lot of really great wildlife um, preserves all around in Sebastian and Vero Beach. Very accessible beaches that are uncrowded. Um, 
free parking, so many great things. I have a ton of videos about um, Vero Beach, the vibe of Vero Beach, the best beaches to visit in Vero Beach. So much great information on this channel. If you wanna click that link above, it'll take you to a playlist with all of those great videos that I've already made. You can take a look at those as well. So in summary, what I want you to know is that Vero Beach is a really beautiful place here in Florida. We are within an hour and a half drive to a ton of really great and exciting Florida destinations. Um, we have a wonderful tropical location. Vero Beach is very accessible from multiple major um, international airports. And we would love to have you come and visit and see how it is to be here at Vero Beach, beautiful, lovely place that I call home. So take a look at those videos. Let me know what you think about this one. Give me a thumbs up. If you have any questions, leave them in the comments for me below, and I'm happy to answer those for you.